sign of progress in the recovery from Hurricane Ian. These were the first Publix delivery trucks arriving back in Matlacha and Pine Island in Lee County. Bring on the groceries. That mm -hmm. shipment finally able to get through after crews restored the causeway to Pine Island. Governor Ron DeSantis was here in the Bay Area today and said it's proof Florida is recovering at record pace. However, tonight in Northport, some people are still without just simple necessities like water and electricity. News Channel 8's Jeff Patterson joins us now live in Northport with that story. Good evening, Jen and Keith. Take a look behind me. There are some downed trees snapped in half here in the North Board, just across from City Hall here. As you mentioned, in this area, they're still having problem. They don't have water. They don't have electricity. Still, Governor Ron DeSantis says those services are being returned to normal across the state at a record pace. Tonight, Art Baltus is focusing on the things he can take control of, the cleanup of debris in his own yard. His Northport neighborhood suffered heavy damage during Ian, and some services have not yet returned. We had really bad uh, cell service. There's no internet on the phones. Not far away, Lourdes Harrop tells us she still doesn't have electricity or running water in her home. We don't have power. You know, they're still working on it. We saw three... Uh, FPL uh, trucks that they went to the other side and they tried to work on it. So we don't have no water yet. But so far we, you know, we, besides the flooded, you know, we did okay. Still, Governor Ron DeSantis says power is being restored all over the state. We've been able to now uh, restore uh, all but 1.86% of the state of Florida has power. The governor also says significant progress is being made to help the people and businesses that have been cut off on Pine Island, and the bridge has already been reopened there. We said we would do it. We did an emergency contract, and we did it in three days. And he says progress is also being made to help the people on Sanibel. We are doing, just like we did with Pine Island, I've authorized repairs to the Sanibel Causeway. If you take a look right there, there is aluminum. Uh, it looks like from a roof that is right in front of the firehouse here. There is debris all over Northport that they are working actively to clean up. We've also seen power company crews in this area working to restore power. Hopefully the people who live here will have their power and water services and their internet back soon. Live in Northport, Jeff Patterson, 8 on your side.